Okay then. I have now rescued Tali. I... Point of interest. Ravena, don't really care. Done that. Another Ravena. Poem shop. Third Ravena. Yeah. I think. What was it? Nope. Get down, Shepherd. And. Ah, this is an upgrade. Nice. Um, I know charm is important. So I'm just gonna fucking max it, because why the fuck not? <laughs> hmm. Oh. Yep. Yep. Um. Yeah, go on. Put everything on too. Um. <laughs> Perhaps I should reduce chance of everything. Nice. Stores a potion of shoes when you're under fire. Nice. Shows all chance to be used immediately. Also nice. Please help it. Yes. Um, three more points. I think I'm going to go... Screw it, give me a little bit more help. Rex. <laughs> oh, Christ. That must reduce three help a second, increase million damage to 50%. This is, ooh, give it to me. Put one on everything. Long, long burst. Nice. I think I'm just going to even everything out. Nice. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Then... Hmm. Very cool. Then it's unlocked. Cool. <laughs> Which increases health. Right. Tally. Jesus. Take resistance. Nice. Like I said, just one and everything. Can't do that, yeah, because obviously unlocking things. Mm hmm. Uh-huh. Oh, that's cool. Sure. <laughs> what does dampening actually do? Increase the explosion radius on your tech proximity mine, shuts down enemy tech. Tally, you are awesome. Just 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 putting it out there. Nope. Okay, that's map. No. Why? Why? Why do you keep doing this, Shepard? Eh. That's items. Hmm. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, there's so much stuff. I will, I will work I will work that out later, I promise. What what, what did I press to make you go slow, Sla Shepherd? What was it? What was it? Oh crap. This is not successful. What did I? What? What? 
Okay, there we go. Jesus. Don't don't just press random buttons. Just look up the fucking guide as to what the goddamn controls are, man. Jesus. Oh, I love you. Oh, how I love them. <laughs> right, I am going to go... I don't know where I'm going to go, if I'm entirely honest. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Yeah, sure. Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh Bhatia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. Okay. It's no trouble. What can I do for you? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. There's no reason for your wife's body to be held like this. Just wait here. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral. And the respect she deserves. And that is completely reasonable. J. J for journal. Makes sense. Uh -huh. Jesus Christ, I have so much to do. Okay. Okay, that's that's the one that's out of. Find the commune. Eh. I'll do them in order. Talking to Matt. He's in the embassy embassy lounge. On the right. Cool. I don't even have to go very far. <laughs> Always a bonus. Always a bonus. Yeah, I got you. Also, look for, look for keepers, because I don't know how many of them I found. I could check, actually. 15 out of 21, okay. Huh. I got more than I thought. I was I was half expecting me to, like, miss hundreds of them. Hello, hello Palin. You. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Yes, yes I am. I'll give that man's wife's body left. In the diplomatic Back. Corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Yes. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. Ah, Mr. Batya. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help him. But do it. Serviceman Nirali Batya died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batya no doubt told you. Yes. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. You're studying her injuries to learn more about Geth weaponry. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Mm, I'm gonna charm you because I have it. Actually, no. How long do you think the research is going to take? I might still charm you. This is a long-term study. I wouldn't expect the bodies to be released for a year or longer. Jesus, that's ridic- That's ridiculous. You've gotta have a lot of bodies. And you said bodies. Can't you release one? Very few bodies had this new type of weapon damage, and very few were in good enough condition to study. Beyond that, Commander, we need as many bodies as we can to get a reasonable sample size. When will this research result in actual new technology? If we're lucky, we'll actually realize usable technology from this study in a few years. I understand what you're trying to do, but holding the body is wrong. Commander! You of all people should understand how far we must go to protect humanity. <laughs> um. Not if we lose our humanity in the process. I'm out there fighting to stop crap. Like this. <laughs> that was a bit more forceful than I expected. 
All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Batia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Yeah, you better Tell not. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Good. And I got Paragon points. Nice. Okay. For Mr. Batia. I am a good person. <laughs> a good, slightly more forceful than necessary person. Wrong room. You have anything to say about this, guys? So much empty space. A thousand of my people could live here and hardly even see each other. Hmm. I get the feeling they're not used to seeing Krogan walking around up here. Yeah, I'd imagine not. And Tally, your people are, like really secretive. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? I reminded Mr. Bosker what we're fighting for. Your wife is coming home. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. Good. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. Bye. Oh, cool. You gave me XP. I was like, not as rude, but you gonna give me anything? You gonna give me anything? Um. Jalid, where is Jalid? Jenna, deliver information. Come on, Verna. Done that yet? I've done that. Scanning them currently. Speak with Gil. Find the commune. Oh. Okay, where is Jalid? Wrong one. Jalid, you little shit. Mm. No, stop this. I'm gonna... I know that guy's in Chloris Den, so I'll go there, because then if Jolly isn't here, I can at least talk to him. Thank you. It's information I already knew. Okay. Well, here's these two. Hopefully nobody's going to try and fucking shoot me again. Because that will be bad for them, not me. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not getting involved in this. Hi, I'll be with you in just a sec. I need to talk to you about your work with CSEC. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking Bullshit. about. Bullshit. Now, if you don't mind, I need to get back to my customers. This isn't the game, Jenna. These people are dangerous. Now you sound like my sister. <laughs> and you broke that quickly. I can take care of myself. I need to go. I'm not a stripper. I don't get paid to stand around and look pretty. Love girl. <laughs> okay. But first. Hello, General Septimus. Commander. What do you want? I'm here on Shayira's behalf. Your lies are hurting her. So stop. Good. <laughs> her lies have been killing me for days. Have they really, though? I've seen a lot of horrible things in my days, and. There's only one woman in this damn galaxy that helps me forget it. This is the great Turian general. How did your kind ever defeat us? Rex, not now. I may be drunk, Krogan, but you're <laughs> ugly. Why are you focusing Tomorrow on Tally? I'll be sober. Unless you have a cure for this ache in my gut. <laughs> Go away. I think I can see why you're upset, but spreading these lies won't make it better. Look, kid, I appreciate don't what call you're me kid. trying to do, but don't waste your time. You need to start acting like a general if you want to beat this. I spent all my life acting like a general, and what did it get me? Huh? No, no 
mistakes are over. I'll just be what I am. A tired, lonely, worn-out soldier. Do you really want to be remembered this way? Come on! No, I'd rather not be remembered at all. But I see your point. So you think it's that easy? Just straighten up and act like a general. Well, yes. It's better than sitting on your ass all day. Blunt but true. Huh. Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort. Even if she won't have me back. This is no place for someone of your stature, General. All right. I'll go to her. After I've had a cold shower or two. <laughs> That's a good decision. Say, you're a bright kid. Would you be interested in earning a few extra credits? Why the fuck what do you not? Want me to do? There's an Elcor diplomat out there who believes Shaira gave up his secrets. I know him. Why would he think such a thing? Because I told him. <laughs> Look, God. I just need you to convince him of the truth. What makes you think you'll believe me? You'll bring him proof. Mm -hmm. Take this data pad. It shows where I got my info. It will exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. Sure, why not? Who am I taking it to? And where is he? His name is Zelta. I know I've He's met him. Diplomat. He was one of the first people I met. He's over in the embassies complaining about Shaira. Well, here's the soldiers acting like soldiers. <laughs> he says and then down to our alcohol. Thanks, Commander. You know, you might make a good general yourself one day. Thank you. Yay! Look at all the look at all the great work I'm doing. Zeltan? Speak with Shaira. Right. <laughs> Rapid transit. Rapid transmit me, the, transmit me the fuck out of here so I can go talk to. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. If you've got questions about Jenna. Meet me at CSEC Academy. What did you just say? Push off. I never did nothing to you. Damn newcomers. Think they can run the place. Subtle. What the hell was that about? I guess we'd better go find out. Oh, I always have so much stuff to do. <laughs> Right. You first. I should probably be looking for keepers as well. I think before I leave I'll just do one big sweep of the entire map. Ah, I was like, where is the Citadel Rapid Transit? Embassies. Right. Go find the Elkul, go find Zeltan, and then go find Shayara. I swear Shayara, that's it's spelled differently, but that's that's like Hawk Girl's name. Am I going to the right one? We shall see. <laughs> Probably not. I am correct, I am. Strange greeting, humans. <laughs> this is really not a good time. Yes, it is. I know who revealed your secret. It was a Turian named Septimus. Unbelieving. I know this Septimus, and he could not learn my secrets. But he did. The only way he could learn them is from the Asari consort. You are mistaken. See this here if you don't believe us. Thank you, Tali. Confused. This is difficult to fathom. If the Turian could learn this on his own, dismayed, <laughs> anyone can discover my secret. The Septimus is a powerful man, and it wasn't easy for him to find. Relieved. I suppose you are correct, human. Thank you for this information. <laughs> Startled realization. I must speak with the consort. 
She will be most displeased with my actions. <laughs> Anxious request. Please, human, if you will excuse me, I must go now. I'm sure she'll forgive you. It was an honest mistake. Doubtful. Perhaps you are right, human. I can only hope so. Jeez, that loud. Thankful. That was a great thing you did, Commander. Approving. You see, Dan, not all humans are as you say. <laughs> I'm That's... sure the Earth Clan stands to profit from this in some way. Oh, go fuck yourself. Little mole. Okay. Jalid. Speak with Shayara. Okay, I'm. Apologetic. Mm. Do not listen to my bolus compatriot. It was a good thing you did, regardless of your intentions. Thank you. At least somebody is fucking reasonable. Let me out. I need to go deal with what is essentially a blue alien prostitute. These things. I was, I was going to use these first, but no, they make it so much easier. Bip. Cool. Don't need to talk to you. Was a long time ago, though. I barely remember. <laughs> what drew you back to the city walls and to the blah, 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 blah. I just need to find Shara. I don't care about what the rest of you are doing. It's not my problem. That's not strange. Commander, I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with That's me. That's right. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. It was my honor to aid you. I'm not going to be that full. You're too kind, Commander. But I would not expect you to help me out of the kindness of your heart. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. What are you offering me? I offer a gift of words, an affirmation of who you are and who you will become. I see your skin, tough as the scales on any Turian, unyielding. A wall between you and everyone else, but it protects you. Makes you strong. I already knew this. That strength is what kept you alive when everyone around you was dying. You alone survived. You will continue to survive. This may be who you are, but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. Hmm. <laughs> you have quite a gift, Shaira. Thank you. Not everyone appreciates it as you do. Never underestimate the power of words. Here, Commander. In light of your efforts with the Elcor Ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. What is it? A small mystery. I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. Okay. Thank Remember you. Remember my words, Commander Shepard. They will give you strength. Yeah. Okay. Um, Chalik, Csec Academy. Where is Jalid? Where is Jalid? That's a good question. Csec Academy. Up awards. Mm. I'll go to Csec first because there's these two here. Yeah, see, second academy it is. Just there are so many. Thankfully, they're all quite quick, but there are so many side missions. No, no, there's like ones that are just floating out in space and shit. So, good lord, how am I gonna find them all? Keeper. Seems like all the best lounges are being. Yeah. 
Yes. <laughs> We've arrived at the Seasack Academy. Good. Cool. Continue along this way. Find some people. Complete some missions. Just, I wasn't expecting, like, the Citadel area to be so long. But, like... It's cool that it is. But, like, still. Hi. You were not who I needed. Oh, it's Jalid. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorban? Yes. I found out you've been lying to me, Jalid. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You lied to us about the Keeper data. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Clearly. I was afraid Shorban would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. What? I'm scanning the Keepers for Shorban, but you two need to stop fighting. You're... You're helping us? But... Well, if you say so. <laughs> Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. I appreciate the help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. Yes. My god, you people are stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> What's wrong with you people? No offense, Commander, but what the hell were you thinking? Hmm? I don't follow you. You could have blown Jenna's cover. <laughs> we were trying to help her. I gathered that. It might seem cold letting her take all the risk, but we're keeping a close eye on her. Do you really need to risk her life to get the information you want? This job isn't easy and it's usually unpleasant. I'll take help anywhere I can find it. But That's since fair. you were so concerned with her safety, Maybe there's a way we can help each other. Sure, why not? Always thinking ahead. I do everything for everybody else. It's part of the job. Now, are you going to help me or not? I'll help you, but I need some details. Yeah. I'm trying to track down an illegal arms producer. I just need some of their product. Thanks to Jenna's intel, I've learned there's a seller here on the Citadel. Okay. Meet our man named Jax. Pick up the mods and bring them back here. That'll give me everything I need. Hmm. Why are you so concerned about these mods? We have access to some of the most sophisticated weaponry there is. It's what gives us our edge. What do you suppose happens when we lose that edge? You will die horribly. These give criminals an advantage we can't afford to let them keep. I'll persuade Jax to tell me where these mods are coming from. No. You tip Jax off and all my leads will disappear faster than you can say bad bust. Okay. Where can I find this, Jax? Jax On the way from the lower <laughs> level of the markets. I'll send word through our channels that you're the buyer. Good luck, Commander. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Low awards. Up awards. No idea where he is. That's a different system. That's scanner keepers. It's a century system in the Hawking Eater cluster. Yeah, that's another one, right. Okay, so that's those. Right, upper wards and lower wards, then. Uh, so many things to do for so many people I don't really know. find someone somewhere here. Assembly Wong. Obsidian. Flux. 
lower markets. Store of gems for lords. Okay. Go around there, get her. Cool. I got you. Yeah, I got you. I am really just gonna have to <laughs> just top to bottom search this place to get the last six, I think. And I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Why has this place got to be so big? I know it has thousands of aliens on it, I know it's a giant space station, but why does it have to be so big? There you are. Word on the street is that you've been busy. Congratulations on taking down Fist. Select. I was sure he was a big player in anything going on here. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. You've got this files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. <laughs> you're welcome. Here, Commander, for your trouble. Thank you. Mm, yes. What would my future cooperation be worth? Say, an interview when my investigation is over? Exclusive? You talk to me before you talk to <laughs> anyone else? If it gets me more stuff. It's worth quite a bit, and I'd be very happy to compensate you accordingly. Here you are. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. <laughs> Charm was a good idea. <laughs> and now. Yeah, this will take me all the way down to the lower ones. Cool. At least it should do. Wrong. There we go. This will take me where I need to go. Got you before. I reckon they're on the top. Like, somewhere. Like, the council chamber and stuff. I reckon they're up there. I, I guarantee I've probably missed some up there. Okay. This way? No, other way. Morlin. Oh, he's a Krogan. Hold it. That's close enough, Army. <laughs> you got my payment? I didn't come here to look. Show him the merchandise. That looks about right. Thank you, Rex. Damn straight it is. These mods are the best on the market. Now hand over my credits. Sure. I won't fuck with anything. Here you go. Here you go. Enjoy it. Come on, boys. We're done here. I don't know if I should have done that. Shunt shot to Chalak. Okay, that was sketchy as fuck. <laughs> I don't particularly like being complicit in crime. Okay, where is he? Along this way. <sighs> God damn it, Shellac. Why, why make me do this? If I get arrested now for you, I'm going to be pissed. Just so you know. Commander, I hear you have something for me. Here's your shipment, Shellac. Excellent. This is everything I need. Huh. 
Maybe more than I need. That sounds sketchy as fuck. Here, Commander, take this. I won't need it. You've earned some payment for your work. Thank you. As for Jenna, I'll make sure we get her out of Kor's den immediately. Good. Now I need to get these mods into evidence. Thanks again, Shepard. That's fine. Don't blow anything up. Or kill anybody. Or do anything sketchy. What? I'm renegade. Oh, wait, no. I'm, I'm slightly renegade. I'm more paragon. Good to know. I don't want to intimidate people, though. <laughs> as fun as that would be. Um, sure. Does Charm only go up to three, or is only, like, as far as I've got? Sure, why not? Rex. Hmm. I'm going to increase health, I think. Yes. <laughs> Good. No, there we go. <laughs> now, if only I knew how to swap my team again. I could level everybody else up. Okay. <laughs> Wrong thing. Journal. Where is Conrad Burner? Right. Rapid transport. And search my way around everywhere. Because that way I can also find more keepers. Because, Jesus Christ, I want them! I know it's just for experience, but I want them. Um. <laughs> There's that one. I've got that one. I hope you don't mind, I'm just going to skulk around everywhere. No, I'm waiting to speak with one of the counselor's assistants. Don't mind me, just doing some skulking. <laughs> Finding some more keepers. Ignore everything I'm doing. <laughs> no, I just want to ask a couple of questions. Well, tough. You're not getting any. <laughs> you have got. I bet you, I'll do all of this, and I'll miss one in a really obvious place, and it will take me ages to find it. Just that's just how this shit goes down. That one. Yes, that's one. Yoink. That's 17. Check across here first. I doubt they'll be that close to each other, but we... It's no harm in looking. Yeah, I've already gone that way, right down there, then up to the silver chamber. Oh, give them to me. Just, just, just have like a stack of four right here. It'll, it'll help me out a lot. <laughs> Nope, that's just the elevator. 
I will look in though, just just in case there is a small passageway. Nope. Right, I'll go to council then. Go and see what the fuck they're on about. Oh yeah, can I um like expose not Garrus, Garrus is my friend. The other guy. The other Turian guy. The evil one. I think I can do that now, because Tally's here. I think she knows. I can't remember, it's been like a week. <laughs> Even the shit, even the running isn't that fast. <laughs> Come on. Udina's presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Okay, but yeah, that was it. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Sarah will be insane. stripped of his spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Venezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Venezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks he can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Don't be so stupid. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. <laughs> this is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. Does it matter? The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the Conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. Let me track him down then. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. Use me and my own personal army. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. You don't have to send a fleet into the Traverse, and the Ambassador gets his human Spectre. Everybody's happy. It's worth it. Commander Shepard, step forward. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. 
Spectres are an ideal, symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. I'm honored, Counselor. We're sending you into the Traverse after Sarah. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. Thank you. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. <laughs> Bastard didn't even thank you. <laughs> He's got a lot on his mind. Come on. Right behind you, Shepard. Yes! Nice.